Now that you've got your very own Blackview, let's go over the installation steps and get you started using your dash cam. We've designed our dash cams to be easy to install without the need for any prior technical knowledge. First, let's have a look at what comes in the box. You'll receive the main unit, micro SD card, 12 volt cigarette lighter adapter or hard wiring cable, cable clips, and spare tape for the camera mount. Depending on your model, auxiliary cameras may be included to record the rear or interior of your vehicle. Some models also include a pry tool to help run the cables. Now we can start the installation. But before we do, consider whether or not you plan to use parking mode. Parking mode is recommended to ensure that your vehicle is covered even when you're away. To use parking mode, you'll need to power your dash cam with the hardwire kit or optional power magic accessory. If you don't plan on using parking mode, a simple installation with a cigarette lighter adapter will do. First, you'll need to place your dash cam in the best place possible. If your dash cam model supports Wi-Fi, you can power your dash cam and connect to it with the Blackview app to see a live video feed for perfect positioning. We recommend placing the dash cam with the lens in the center of your windshield. But don't worry, the dash cam's view angle should be wide enough to cover most of the scene in front of your vehicle. Just avoid placing the dash cam too low, resulting in your hood blocking the view. When you've found the best placement, simply remove the adhesive tape's cover and press firmly while holding the dash cam with both hands. To unmount the camera, simply press the lock button and slide the camera out of the mount. The side cover can be opened to reveal the micro SD card slot. Here you can insert and remove the micro SD card easily. Now that your dash cam is in place, let's look at how to power it. In this video, we will cover installation using the cigarette lighter power adapter. If you plan on hardwiring your dash cam, be sure to review our video on hardwire installation. Start by plugging the cable into the DC in power socket. Secure the power cable to the top of the windshield by using one of the included cable clips. Hide the power cable by running it through the space between the windshield and the headliner. Continue routing the cable along the A-pillar down the bottom of the passenger's door. Finally, run the cable under the glove compartment to the cigarette lighter socket using cable clips when needed. Follow similar steps as the front camera to mount the rear camera at the top of the rear window. Pay attention to the orientation of the camera. Next, locate the included coaxial cable. Plug the unit into the coaxial connector on the main unit. Secure the cable to the top of the windshield using a cable clip. Run the cable in the space between the windshield and headliner, continuing along A pillar, B pillar, to C pillar at the back of the vehicle. Here you can hide the excess cable. Finally, plug the cable into the rear camera connector. To power your dash cam, plug the power cord into your car's power socket and turn the key to on. Your Blackview will automatically start recording. Now that your dash cam is installed, here are a few tips to get you started. First, if your dash cam supports Wi-Fi, download the free Blackview app for iOS or Android. You can also install the Blackview viewer for Mac OS and Windows from blackview.com forward slash downloads. For more information on connecting to your dash cam through Wi-Fi, be sure to check out our Wi-Fi tutorial video. When setting up your dash cam, be sure to check your time zone and speed unit settings. Always save your settings to apply them once you are done. Now you're all set up to enjoy the benefits of your Blackview dash cam. For more information, go to blackview.com.